Hi there, this is my uh, my garden um, in uh, Bedfordshire. Um, you can see it's uh, snow all the way around on the floor and uh, it's about minus three, minus five outside, but inside, as you'll see in a minute. Inside here, it is a beautiful little tropical paradise. We have on the gauge, we have plus 10 degrees on there. Um, it's really quite pleasant, quite quite nice inside. Um, we've got a range of salad growing all year round in really quite lovely conditions inside um, inside this uh, this uh, polytunnel. Got an aquaponic system which is uh, running down into this gravel bed as you can see here. Uh, the gravel beds are um, 0.3 of a meter deep um, and we've got three of them uh, this this whole framework is made out of um, free recycled um, scaffold boards um, and then I've just um, inlaid the inside with uh, three layers of pond fiberglass um, that you can buy off, off the net um, fairly, fairly cheaply, it's like a, like a pond liner fiberglass um, and then I've got uh, a couple of mechanical filters which uh, take out the fish poo and um, excess feed that goes in. A couple of those in there. Um, and I've got a fish food which is in these containers. And that's just uh, that's for the tilapia. <coughs> it's uh, um, uh, the uh, they're vegetarian, so they just have a um, a dry pellet mix. Um, there the uh, the aquaponic system the water filters down from the base from these big base tanks um, as you see here, here the uh, the fish quite like um, to be in the in the dark the tilapia um, there's 105 of them in there um, in a constantly cycling system um, you can see it's not too clear because the amount of the amount of uh, steam we've got coming off the top of the tank is uh, is set at 25 degrees inside the tank there um, for the uh, tilapia, so they're they're lovely and warm. And there's 100 and 105 fish in there in total. Um, some of them are, are about 250 grams, um, ranging down to about 50 grams. Um, it's uh, February now, and in hopefully in sort of May time. They'll be um, they'll be ready to eat at about half a kilogram, about 500 grams. Um, over here, I'm experimenting with some uh, some some roller tanks, um, which have got uh, compost um, being produced in them. Um, if you open these doors, these doors up, um, and there's uh, various things rotting down inside there. Um, it provides a nice bit of CO2 for the plants for them to grow nicely and also releases heat as well when you when you turn it um, it uh, can generate um, internally can generate about 70 degrees of heat uh, inside this so it's like a little central heating system um, I'm sort of toying with the idea of taking these out and putting a chicken coop in here because the chickens um, produce about eight BTUs per chicken. It's kind of like a small radiator. Um, plus, also the uh, the chicken, f the, uh, the 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 excrement from the chicken can uh, provide quite a nice uh, compost for the outside uh, garden um, as well. And we're looking to do a wormery in the corner over there um, to. Uh, um, Produce a uh, an organic feed, um, organic feed for the for these plants, and also a uh, 
um, a, a natural insecticide to keep the green fly population down. And we've got some green fly over here, that you can see. These are, these are constantly running water systems. As you can see there, the water runs um, up through these, these drain pipes, um, around the system, and then back down through the gravel and back down into these pipes. So it's constantly cycling all the time. Um, as you go and uh, the plants as you can see are really 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 flourishing we have uh, we have spinach we have um, uh, mixed lettuce uh, peppered lettuce um, we also have um, uh, peas starting in there as well we have egamami beans um, pok choy um, kale and we've also yeah also got some red kale in there as well which is growing quite nicely in these uh in these 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 quite nice uh, clay pebbles um so uh that's it for me uh my name's ross and uh if uh, if you have any further questions i'll i'll uh, i'll put Put those on a on a on a blog on the uh, on the, on the website as well. Okay.